Hello, this is John, JD, PhD, Finance Concentration. I'll be talking about Portfolio Beta in this video. Here's a Portfolio Beta example. The question is, what's the Portfolio Beta for this three-stock portfolio? This is just a hypothetical practice example. Uh, this uh, portfolio only has three stocks. It likely would exhibit uh, quite a bit of unsystematic risk. Beta is a measure of systematic risk. The beta of the overall stock market is 1. Beta measures the sensitivity of the stock to the overall stock market. Usually betas range from 0 0.5 up to 1.5, although they can be outside that zone. A stock that has a beta greater than 1, say 1.3, has exhibited more uh, volatility uh, to the market, more sensitivity to the market than a stock with a beta say of 0 0.75. Market timers are particularly interested in portfolio beta because if they anticipate a stock market falling they would most likely try to reduce the portfolio beta. If they anticipated that the stock market would be advancing they most likely would be increasing the portfolio beta. So let's go through uh, this example here only three stocks and we see the investment uh, in each stock in the specific stocks beta and in order to get the portfolio beta it's just a weighted average in general the portfolio beta is the summation of i equals 1 to n of wi beta i um, here I just ex there's only three stocks in the portfolio so I, I wrote it out here W1 beta 1 plus W2 beta 2 plus W3 beta 3 where the WIs that's the investment weight and the beta I's the stocks beta. So first we need to determine the weights. We don't have the weights we have the investment. You have to add up the total uh, all, all three of these investments here to get the to total uh, portfolio value. So it's 10,000 plus 20,000 plus 30,000 this portfolio is a $60,000 portfolio. So divide each investment by the total portfolio value to determine the weights. The weight in stock 1 is 10,000 divided by 60,000 or one-sixth of the portfolio is in stock 1. Uh, the weight in stock 2 is $20,000 divided by 60,000, one-third. So one-third of the portfolio is in stock 2. Uh, weight of stock 3 is uh, half of the portfolio, $30,000 divided by 60000 So just plug these numbers into the, the formula there, and you should end up with a portfolio beta of 1.14. And again, that's a little uh, higher than the m overall stock market's beta, which is 1. Thank you.